Is it smooth? I can't really tell. Because the monitor that I use to check everything is working is not the greatest, so... Hopefully it looks fine. I already talked to you. I haven't talked to you. Have you met the other farmers in our community? There are more? Oh no. We already tried to check on George, right? So he's probably in here? Maybe? Is he in here? Nope, nobody in here. Okay! Oh, there's Sean. What's Sean doing? Shane, why are you bothering me? I want to be alone. Sure you do, Shane. Sure you do. What is this box? I don't remember what that box does. Dear Harvey, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Falcon Town. It's rewarding work. Hope you'll find your own work equally rewarding in time. This is a nice house. Who lives here? Olivia? Oh my, aren't you a cutie? Welcome to the valley, dear. So exciting when someone new moves in. Have you met my son, Victor? Victor? Oh no, this is turning into a soap opera. Uh-oh. Run away! Oh, there they are. It's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? There's so many of them. Name's George, by the way, now. Buzz off. Hello, ma'am. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear Evelyn. You can call me Granny if you like. Evelyn, you're a sweetie. Hang on. Wait. This is my favorite thing! Thank you. We, we give... We give uh, Evelyn a parsnip, and she's just like, ah, what do I do with this? Oh wait, that was probably Victor. Hey, Victor! Victor! Oh hey, you're the new owner of Sketching Farm. I'm Victor. It's a pleasure to meet you, Jacob, isn't it? Yep. Okay, cool. Bye! Who is this? Oh, hey, farmer, what's up? Don't mind me, I'm kind of hungover. Oh, I feel that. You should try hanging out at the saloon on Friday sometimes. Most of the town hangs out there. Oh, I bet you there's too many people in there. I even get Henry to come with me sometime. Sometimes, sometimes. You need help with your animals? No? Oh, I thought that was why you'd come to see me. Aw. Is anybody in here on a Sunday, Saturday? Nope, there's Pam and there's Mike. Hello, it's nice to meet you. And that kid name's Pam. Hello, Pam. Pam. Pam is great. Oh, and then this, our beloved uh, Emily. Oh, she looks so cute. I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. <laughs> so she doesn't know where we are. That's fine. It happens to everybody. I get lost all the time. Oh, this storeroom's changed. There's frozen Grampleton orange chicken in the fridge. Olive oil. can't click on it. I don't know what this is about. Do I put stuff in here? I don't know. There's a third game in the lineup. Okay, let's get out of here. That's Clint. We've talked to Clint plenty before. That's Marnie. All right. Wait, we, wait, we didn't talk to Gus, did we? I'm a doofus. Sorry, Gus. Just kind of ignored you. Didn't mean to. Nonetheless. Why would I 
smell that? It's the hash browns? Oh, does he, he just sells, he sells a bunch of different things. Okay, what do we want? Tortilla would be good. Bread would be good. Eggs, omelet. Mm. Hash browns is just potato and oil. We can do that. We'll be making some of this stuff in no time, I hope. Mixed berry pie? Ooh. Did we actually talk to him, though? That doesn't count, right? Did he just change clothes on us? Well, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. Did they give it an official title? I think they did. Also, can we... I'm not going to be in here any longer. I've changed the music. Huh? Gross noise. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, dang, my pizza dinner. Self Jacob, sorry about that. Happens to everybody at some point. I might have had a few too many. Shane and I were playing a drinking game while watching Quint. He doesn't exactly like being done up. Maybe you should play with us one of these nights. We'll cash in those drinks, I owe you. It won't leave you wanting. I don't know about getting drunk. Sounds like a fun time. Maybe not this much, though. Yeah, don't don't kill yourself drinking. Moral of the story, drink in moderation. I work early tomorrow. I guess I should head home before Mia drags me back. Night! Did you not tell Gus about the mess? Thanks, Farmer. Willie! It's nice to see new young folk moving into the valley. It's not very common these days. Back in my day, we had dozens of youngsters who were all ready and raring to go and we built this village up with our bare hands. Ah, oh, it closes at six. Oops. Nothing important to do, we're just heading back to our farm, I guess. We're completely out of energy for the day. Gunther locked up, so we couldn't give us the stuff that we wanted to give him. Let's add some parsnips to this. Get rid of that and then go to bed. I like that when you inherit the house in this modded version, it doesn't look like it was decorated for Christmas. I never fully understood that. Oh, we got a skip crop. You know what would be crazy and screwed up? As if the way to get a recipe for a scarecrow was to have crows eat some of your seeds. That'd be insane. I'm gonna walk out there and there's gonna be crows, right? Ooh, thank goodness, not this time. Okay. Wood, coal, fiber. Easy. 
We should do this first, but... Making sure that everyone is all watered up. Make sure to stay hydrated. Cause if you aren't hydrated, then you might just run out of energy and crash. And that's no fun. There's gotta be a faster area to get water from. I could build a well. Not yet. I probably can't yet, actually. If we just run to our left, do we run into water? It might be a little bit faster if I made a path to it that was more of a green line. Into the brink with you! I don't think, maybe that wasn't right. I think it's brink. Maybe brink wasn't the right word. Boop. 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 Got lots of wood. Okay, so we just run to the left to fill the water up. That's fine. I just heard you moved from the townsfolk, so I wanted to officially welcome you to the valley. My name is Mia, and I'm one of your fellow neighbors. Why don't you come over sometime? Sterling, Henry, and I live over on the east straight. Scarf. Scarf? And we'd be happy to have you. I love having guests over for lunch. But as I'm sure you're very busy. I've been close to you. Oh, She's too sweet. I hope to see you soon. We're, we're never going to see her. We're never, we're never going to have time to get over there. I'm gonna need teleportation just to get back without trying. Uh, we wanted. We don't have enough money to get that yet. We've got this. We can make scarecrows now, right? We managed to get this far without incident, and hopefully two of these will be enough. Oh. Uh. I, I could have solved this problem. I didn't. There we go. We really need to sell stuff here. Oh, that's super useful. Yo, that's so convenient. Things that the original game should have had, but I understand why it didn't, but also, they could still add it. Nobody would complain. Okay. We chop the trees down, we get the wood. We're gonna, we're gonna need it, because we're gonna need wood for a lot of things, I believe. Including, but not limited to, brewery stuff. Beekeeping stuff? Other things involving wood? Chairs, tables, can you even make those? I don't know, maybe a mod lets you, I have no idea. At the very least, it increases our XP. Oh, the traveling merchants here. Let's go talk to them. We definitely don't have money right now. Do they want to sell? Go talk to Piers. Is he open on Sundays? Oh, frick, I don't remember. Give me all the rocks, all you've ever had, all you've ever had, and I will shine all of the rocks for you, make them look like pretty stones too. What is this? 
Lux not on our side today. It's Lewis's birthday. Well, that's convenient. We've already talked, so I don't need to talk to her. I don't know what to give him. You think he'd like a leaf? No. Give. Happy birthday. Did my birthday come fa come up faster than you expected? Thank you for trying, Jacob. Oh, I tried. Do, do, do. I don't know what you would like. Some people like leeks. Other people don't. I understand. Wait, I can plant trees? I guess I can't... Oh, I can plant trees. Oh, that's cool. You have a tree. Okay. Are we... We're going to Gunther. We should stop by Clint first. I'm happy. I'm feeling glad I got sunshine. In a bag and I'm useless, but not for long, the future is coming on. I ain't happy, I'm feeling glad I got sunshine. In a bag and I'm useless, but not for long, the future is coming on. Honey harvested here is used in a variety of dishes served at town festivals. Who dis? New farm, who dis? Someone forgot to clean this. Oh no! What's... Forgot to clean... These crates have seeds from piers in them. What? Is this Pelican Town Community Garden? Oh, I bet you Evelyn has a blast here. Or she used to, probably, at least. Oh man, I'm excited to grow trees all over town. Maple trees everywhere. That was an acorn tree, but we can grow maple trees too. Maples, maples everywhere. No maple syrup to drink. Maples, maples everywhere. Maple syrup is brown and not pink. It's nice to be close to the ocean. The sound of the sea makes going to sleep a lot easier. Aww. Does she have anything else? As kids, we hunted for seashells after the tides went out. Those were the days. Aww. Strange nostalgia. We need to go talk to Willy and get ourselves a fishing rod. Because, you know, we need more stuff to do in the game and not let... What? Seaside. We got a seaside. That's cool. A seaside, seaside uh, farm. Is there somebody home? Nobody is home. Hmm. Whose house is this? Filled with wine bottles. Oh, it's the person that does vine vineyard stuff. Blue Moon Vineyard. Right. I was going to say we talked to them, I think. Where does this go? It's like a whole new world. A whole new world. I mean, this is basically what I want from Stardew Valley updates is to just make the world bigger. Because it's such a nice place. I enjoy it. A whole new world. Do you think? Oh, I've got so distracted so easily, guys. Oh my goodness. Oh, I should clean this up so that nobody is upset. The fact that I can dig more here is funny. Take us back to the beach, except we want to go. I want to see if there's anything weird on the normal path or n unique. Also, can we go further this way? No. Oh, hi, Willie. I know where I am. I'm, I'm at the beach. 
This isn't a beach, this is a bathtub. Ahoy there, son. Heard there, heard there was a newcomer in town. Glad to finally meet ya. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out at the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. And I'm giving you my old one. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. Hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Da -na -na -na. You got an old fishing rod. You have no space. Frick. I guess we're getting rid of the dandelions. It's always the dandelions that go first. Sorry, dandelions. There's good water here in the, old, in, in the valley. All kinds of fish. Like literally over 30 different species. Like completely different. They're all over the place. Maybe even over 50. My shop's back up, open now, so if you need supplies, I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. Hey, hey, that's what my old poppy used to say anyway. I don't know why, but I just had like a vivid moment where it looked like the dock was sinking. Made me a little nervous. Oh. And you are? Hello. I hope your new farming life is panning out as you'd hoped. Uh, it's going pretty well. Excuse me, Willie. If you purchase a high quality fishing rod, you'll be able to attack bait and tackle. Bait and tackle. Tackle and bait. Who dis? New town, who dis? Carmen. Today should be a good day for fishing. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? I'm over here. What is this? Willie's fish ba ba basket? Okay. It's a little weird. Alright. I can't pick this up. I can't believe a mod ha hasn't changed this. This wreckage looks like it's been here for years. And I can't do anything about it? What the? Uh, let's go see if there's anything happening over here. Oh, do we don't have enough wood. We need 200, don't we? 300? Okay. Fine. It's fine. We will get more wood. Can't pick crap up because I don't have inventory space. I'm going to go ahead and flip that. It looks like a little bear. It's cute. We're gonna pick up this stuff and then we're gonna. Is this is this a thing that uh, our dude, our friend, Gunther? Oh, he's closed. Wasn't that the one thing we said we wanted to do today? Was get to Gunther and give him the stuff. We don't have inventory space as it is. Ah, I'm out of inventory space. Ah. Hmm. Okay, if we chop, we can clean up parts of this at least. Wait, oops. I got confused there for a second. Inventory is full, and we are in high spirits. Our inventory is full. He's right, it's full. I can't believe it. Our inventory is totally full. Let me keep buying expansions to my inventory. If I could upgrade it to triple the size of the base game, that'd be cool. Man, it... Oh, kind of felt like I teleported there, even though I know I didn't. Okay, we're going to chop down some trees. 
so that we don't waste eating the, the bear. We didn't eat a bear, we ate bear pancakes. Bear shaped bear pancakes. Oh, our level is in the is in the bottom. Are they all like that? I guess so. Our level is in the bottom left. That's kind of cool. For each little thing. You got a thing. You leveled up. Can't wait to get a light ring from the uh, from the dungeons. Not the dungeons, but you know the caves. I was gonna say just one more. We put the wood away. We pick up all the sap and sell it today. That way we don't have to deal with it later. Literally can't see where I'm going. But that's fine. Perfect. Nope, 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 nope. Open the door. Open the door. Everybody do the dinosaur.